Tonight marks the eighth year that I've come here to report on the State of the Union. And for this final one, I'm going to try to make it a little shorter. I know some of you are antsy to get back to Iowa. Anyone claiming that America's economy is in decline is peddling fiction. Now, what is true, and the reason that a lot of Americans feel anxious, is that the economy has been changing in profound ways. Food stamp recipients did not cause the financial crisis. Recklessness on Wall Street did. You know, last year, Vice President Biden said that with a new moonshot, America can cure cancer. I'm putting Joe in charge of mission control. The United States of America is the most powerful nation on Earth, period. And we sure don't need to push away vital allies in this fight by echoing the lie that ISIL is somehow representative of one of the world's largest religions. If you doubt America's commitment or mine to see that justice is done, just ask Osama bin Laden. If you want a better politics, it's not enough just to change a congressman or change a senator or even change a president. We have to change the system to reflect our better selves. I believe in change because I believe in you, the American people. And that's why I stand here as confident as I have ever been that the state of our union is strong. Thank you. God bless you.